Works, and though animal control officials across our area and across the country experience one of the busiest days of the year, lost pets who get spooked by those loud noises eventually find their way to shelters. Hopefully, with the help of some good Samaritans and WLWT News 5's Giacomo Luca live with the best ways to get them back home, Giacomo, safely. Yeah, that's right, Kelly. If your pets went missing amid all the fireworks, the worry could be setting in. We all know losing a pet can be like losing a family member. Don't worry, though. Animal Rescue say this happens every year, and they have some advice on ways to get them back. We're probably going to get a lot of calls or emails about my dog is missing. Can you help? Um, that type of stuff is going to come in um, in the days following that after these you know if missing dogs come off stray hold and an owner hasn't come forward we're going to get hit hard with all of the requests from shelters now if your pet has gone missing start by calling your local animal shelter uh, make sure you'll also want to pull any proof of ownership like photos, vet records, or adoption pa paperwork. You can also file a missing pet report with services like Paw Boost. It's kind of like an amber alert for pets. And if you have found a stray, you're going to want to go ahead and check the collar, obviously look for tags. Uh, and if there aren't any tags, or even if there are, you can bring them into a local animal shelter where they can scan for a microchip, uh, which would be the best way to get those pets back to the owners. And of course, uh, we're told a majority of pets go missing within just two miles of home. So it's very likely maybe a neighbor even picked up the pet. Uh, and we'll be able to help you get them back. We're live this morning outside the Cincinnati Animal Care Shelter. Giacomo Luca, WLWT News 5. Giacomo, thank you. Hopefully everybody can get those pets back yeah. home safely. You know, it's just